At least your accent makes sense now. Yeah. Fraser's not exactly an Indian surname, either. It was my mom's. Let's find a way to get back down to the car. Sounds good. Ah, this is open now. by the falls left. Sounds like a plan. Makes more sense why it solves after the tusk now. Figured he just wanted the money, like us. He'll use it to rally people to his cause, wavered in the government's face. Just like all the other times. This has happened before? Oh yeah. Ever since the young king lost to the Persian, everyone's wanted to lay claim to this land. Here I thought we were just going on a treasure hunt. We are. Let men like Asav fight over it. None of our concern. Fighting wars was my concern for a time. Good point. But you did it for the cash. Usually. What about when you worked with Asav? <laughs> Definitely a cash grab. Hardly worth the trouble. Ouch. Why do it then? Needed to establish my rep, eh? Figured I'd stop with the worst of the bunch. Nowhere to go but up after that. One sec. Simple. What have we got here? Hop in my pocket, little token. Beautiful out here. Is this your first visit to India? Yeah. Not a lot of perks in this line of work, but travel is definitely one of them. Where have you been? Uh, where haven't I been? Whichever question works for you. Well, I haven't been to the States. Really? Yeah, well, the stuff I'm looking for is usually old, right? The US was only founded a couple of hundred years ago. True. What about you? Where do you want to go? Iceland. Nice choice. Beautiful there. Well, it's quiet. I'm spoiled. And I want to see those northern lights. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's on the bucket list, too. You should go when we're done here. Someday. Wait a second. Shit. There's guys all over there. Let's get a closer look. All finished. The turret is set up. Finally. What took you so long? Couldn't find the manual. Manual? 
This is exactly what I've been saying. This gear's outdated. We need real weapons if we're supposed to be a proper army. Be grateful for what we do have. Huh. Isn't Azab always saying that the poor shouldn't be? Ah! Once again. You've waited hundreds of years for me to find you. After all that, you found anything? Got me something shiny. <laughs> okay. Okay, so we were talking about... Anyway, like I was saying, someday. Have other things to attend to first. Rebels beat us here. Check it out. It's Ganesh's fighting. Man. Glad I climbed that tower, eh? Ganesh. Remover of obstacles. He's a good one to know. You pray to him when you start something new, or need to clear your mind of doubts and worry. Oh. Oh, remover of obstacles. Exactly. But why the elephant's head? Ah, well, his father Shiva gave it to him. Is the gate secured? Not yet. I've Waiting on back. Cobra 8. Let's just keep this quiet as long as we can. <laughs> oh, shit. Saw something. Make sure it's nothing. What did you find? Hey, you hear me? Area. You that way. What do you have? Anything? I don't see it.
That's a lot of them. You all right? Fine. Just thinking of all the ways that could have gone better. See, I'm thinking about how it could have gone worse. Much more positive outlook, sort of. Hmm. Okay, that's not it. No, this. What's the trick here? What? Looked like a button. Yeah, I just. Wanted you to have a go at something. What's this? That's a good sound. One of the spokes on the wheel just turned around. And how about you? That's two. Here's another one. Three down. Only one left. <laughs> Last but not least. That should do it. Okay. Back to the big wheel thing. Big wheel thing? Whatever the archaeological term for it is. Mm, big wheel thing works. Come on. Looks like we're going under. Radio. <laughs> There's our faucet. One trident coming up. What the hell? That's not fair. It's Ganesh. Hello, sir. Come on, let's get this over and done with. Yep. Whoa! Shit! See? I told you it was dangerous. You hurt. Just my dignity. Be water. And now that's three. You know, you're pretty good at this whole treasure hunting thing. I'm a quick study. Mm. One question, though. I reckon that you could pretty much do anything you want. Why are you so keen to get Shoreline back? Seriously? Hmm. 
My partner turns my own men against me. My lieutenant makes off with a bounty. Nathan and Samuel Drake get off scot-free and you're asking why I want Shoreline back. Yeah. It was on my watch. I lost it on my watch. All right, what the hell is that thing you keep playing with? It's my stress toy. It showed up in the mail a few weeks after we got to Australia. All right, I better get a move on. We don't want Asav to get ahead of us. You know, I've had my fair share of screw-ups. <laughs> you just pick yourself up and move on. I don't like to fail. No one does, love. Last one back to the car buys dinner. I brought MREs. Ugh. You're no fun. What things are those? No real combat. Ah. Slightly impulsive. Run around the field like a maniac. Need to learn what short, controlled burst means. Right. Lost. Wearing red in a jungle combat scenario. I mean, seriously. Hey, if you want to look anywhere else out there, now's the time to do it. Right. I'm just going to take a look around. Yeah, I'll keep an eye out. a little cave over there.
can't hide from me. Hey, fancy a ride in my pocket? Found anything interesting? Had a little laugh. Last week. Look, for what it's worth, it's your kick-ass reputation that got you this job. Plus, I figured you could use the money. You're not wrong. Honestly, though, it's actually nice working with a woman for a change. <laughs> Too rot. Not many of us out here. This one arms dealer demanded to speak to the man in charge, then tried backing out when I informed him I was running the show. Hold that thought. I'm taking you with me. Is there a quiet way to do that? No. Throw it out anything? Found a little something. Naka. As I was saying, or you were, what were we saying? You were working about an arms dealer. Um, yeah. So anyway, this one arms dealer demanded to speak to the man in charge, then tried backing out when I informed him I was running the show. Ugh, what did you do? Broke both his legs. <laughs> You're not kidding. Just trying to level the playing field. Oh, don't cross Ross. <laughs> I should put that one on my business card. Can't you just walk... Hey, hey, I'll be right back. Fraser? <laughs> One, right? Eleven Hoysala kings, eleven tokens. Should we go visit that place with the monkeys? Up to you. You're driving. That's right. I am. Ah! <clears throat> okay. What were we talking about again? Yeah. So, anyway, can't you just walk away to be done with Shoreline? I was born in Toots. I don't have a choice. Oh, there's always a choice. Hey, let's poke about. Right behind you. We 
got a prize. A very nice prize indeed. This'll fetch a pretty penny back home. If I don't keep it. Now what? Let's go see. Maybe there'll be something for you. Hey, look who's here. Grey Langley. Huh? The Grey Langley. You're adorable. <laughs> oh, and now you're blushing. The Grey Langers. I like the way their faces are ringed with hair. Whoa, hey! <laughs> That was amazing. God. Right, let's go see what the deal is with those waterfalls. All righty, let's roll. Fraser, need to ask you something. It's important. Go ahead. You and Nathan drink. Professional relationship? Mostly professional. Oh, God. How? How? Hey, you're not one to talk about questionable choices, mate. Asab and that other one, the trust fund brat. They weren't a choice, they were means to an end. What drink? He wasn't so bad. I mean... She just thinks he's so clever. Oh, he's incredibly irritating. Impossibly so, but he's charming in his own way. And it was fun while it lasted. That's all one can ask for, I suppose. But I have to ask, did you two take turns talking or did you just talk over each other? Coming. Oh, I'm in. <sighs> Magnificent. How long do you suppose it takes to carve something like this? Years. Decades, even. The Hoi Salah certainly did have a knack for stonework. And the war, it seems. That too. They must have made these to commemorate their victories against the Persians. Looks like they put up a good fight. They did. Pity it didn't last. But their loss is our gain, right? That carving looks familiar. That carving is an exact match for the disc. So what does that mean? I don't know yet. But I'm guessing we should give that a try. Should we dance? Try not to break it this time. Sassy. What the hell? Expecting that. You ready? Yeah. Just um taking it all in.
Welcome to downtown Halabadu. The last known resting place, the Tusk of Ganesh. Spectacular. Huh. And what? Doesn't it look like there's a dam or something between the two Ganesh statues? Must have been eroded by the falls. So how do we get in? Hang on. Yeah. Look at the crown. It's not wear and tear. You're right. Maybe it was a watchtower. Bet that's how the Persians got in. I have heard about this place for so long. <laughs> I can't believe I'm actually looking at it. You should take a picture. Send it to your dad. <laughs> Great idea. What? You're one of those cultures who can't work a computer? Just take the picture. Show it to him in person then. No, it's uh, just a few decades too late for that. Oh, oh, God, please, no. It's fine. <laughs> Shall we, uh, head over to Hullabadoo? <laughs>